Chicken bites like you've never seen before. Let's start today's recipe with a tablespoon of butter inserted into a frying pan. Be sure to make this recipe at home. After reaching this consistency, we add 800 grams of chicken thigh. After a while frying, we will turn to fry on both sides until they are more or less this color. Now let's add the juice of a lime, then three garlic cloves. One tablespoon of soy sauce. A teaspoon of salt. Half a teaspoon of black pepper. A teaspoon of paprika. And we will mix very well to add the flavor of the seasonings. And before I forget, tell me which city you're watching so I can send you a special hug. Today's hug goes to Bonnie Vanderhart from North Carolina. I'm glad you're enjoying our recipes. Now let's add two tablespoons of ketchup. A tablespoon of honey. Tell me if you have any recipes with chicken thigh. I'd love to know. And a tablespoon of mustard. And we mix the ingredients very well to add to the flavor. Now let's add 200 milliliters of water. And we keep mixing the ingredients. Answer honestly, this recipe makes our mouths water. Now let's cover the pan to cook for 10 minutes. After that time, let's loosen the recipe of the pan to be able to remove it. This recipe has become routine here at home. I'm sure as soon as you try it, it will become routine in your home as well. People, I love this recipe. I'm sure you and all your family will like it too. I do it myself every weekend and when I do nothing, my family loves it and asks me to do it forever. Using only a few ingredients present in everyday life, we can make a recipe much tastier than those sold in conventional restaurants. To finish the recipe, we add parsley to taste. Teach your friend who loves chicken thigh. I'm sure he'll love this recipe. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. Thank you so much for watching this video so far. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.